Hello, this is Jitesh, and today I will tell you a Kafka example in the Spring Boot. Okay, so in the Kafka example, I will tell you how to produce. Uh, basically, we are using the producer to send a message into the topic. Okay, and also I will show you one Kafka tool that is Offset Explorer. So you can view and uh, see the your uh, messages. in offset explorer okay that is that is the tool actually and producer example rest send message in kafka topic i will show you so so let's start okay so for this first of all we need to create a spring initializer we use the spring initializer for creating a restful application okay simple way as it is we are doing previously select the maven java version and put your group for example jitesh tag guru put artifact kafka example kafka example and okay and here description for example kafka example okay and 17 add dependency what we need to add dependency first of all web spring web and what simple put the kafka k a f k a kafka spring for apache kafka messaging this is we need actually so two dependencies we need click the generate once you click the generate there is a zip file available explore it and import into your eclipse okay so from the basic structure you will uh, find of the project now come to the project so for this specifically uh, we need to make sure like uh, we need to start zookeeper first this is the zookeeper as in my last video i told you how to start kafka from your local machine the same way in we need to do start zookeeper so this command we are hitting zookeeper server dot bat and this configuration file we need to pass it from the cmd so make sure the zookeeper will, will should start first and then kafka start these two command need to execute first and then open the ide uh, intellij so i already started you can see it uh, this is the zookeeper my started and this is kafka started so in my machine this is already running now it's time to create on work on the application level okay so from the application level we are imported the application uh, from the spring initializer okay so what what dependencies it's add let's see so here we are adding the web and dependencies we adding the kafka this is the kafka basically and if you put the kafka and kafka test is also added okay so two dependencies required for the kafka example okay next one we need to this is the controller okay basically so this is the start class simple as it, as usual all the application have now we need to do some uh, setting like server dot port by default 8080 but if you put additional it's okay so server dot port is 1890 i am putting here 1890 and we need to put another configuration thing that is spring dot kafka dot producer dot bootstrap dot server local host colon 9092 yeah one make sure if it is yml file and it is not coming uh, in your machine then you need to install one plugin uh, i will show you how to install so you go to the search double click Double shift in uh, IntelliJ. Open the plugins. So once you see the plugins, you have a Spring something. A Spring Boot helper. Okay. A Spring Boot Assistant. This is the plugin you need to install, so it will come automatically. For example, if you put something like. like uh, here if you if you are putting something like uh, a spring you can see na 
this is a helper is uh, available if you put control space or simply uh, spring so it helper is comes after that if whatever you want you can do just it automatically it's uh, arranged as yml format okay so no need to push uh, extra effort just you need to install plugin so it will help automatically okay so this setting we need to put this uh, configuration thing server dot port server dot kafka producer and bootstrap server bootstrap server is basically where your kafka server is running so in my machine this is 9092 port this is the default thing so this is the first class so in the default you put the default and create a service class basically so there is a spring uh, inbuilt classes there is a spring class kafka template okay so use the kafka template and i put it auto wired and i create a message uh, public uh, publish message l i s h publish message okay s h is still mistake okay publish message and template dot send any message name you can put so i will make sure like i will update in my uh, respected class also this uh, service class you created and also you need to create one controller class which controller event controller or any controller at the rest controller i put and here publish message okay so auto add kafka publisher and get mapping publish message mess this is the url we are passing and simple i am nothing especially i'm just passing the message first okay so i'm passing the message okay so first of once you pass the message it will create first time your topic this is the topic basically if you open the kafka publisher service class this is the topic it will create okay it will topic it will create let me restart this application okay so once it is restarted i will show you ha huh. till the time i will uh, i can show you this is the last moment i started kafka event for example quick start i hit anything like testing enter so you can see another window this is the another window here message is coming this is the topic this is the quick start event topic but i want to create new topic here so i pass the my topic name here jitesh tag guru demo topic 1 okay so this is started okay how to install uh, this uh, offset explorer simple go to the offset explorer site offset explorer kafka tool.com download of google if you put go offset explorer in google it will come in this site download it respected uh, uh, os and then next step next it will install once it is installed you need to configure okay you need to configure it simple way just test this it will add connect by default okay so uh, you, you can use this one and also once it is uh, click and refresh it so i have you can see na quick start event this is topic created by the command so click on the partition and send you will see the data here ha huh. if your data is seeing your something uh, hexadecimal format you make sure like you click the topic whatever your topic go to the partition and key value put the string and update once you updated it will show data in your visible format in your actual format okay so here we can see like jitesh tag guru demo i executed initially so let's see in the partition data hello i inserted let's hit another command like hello jitesh tag guru okay i send it hello jitesh tag guru send successfully so it means it published the message let's uh, check this once so here uh, just refresh it click the partition right click and refresh or simply refresh command here present open the data run it 
you can see another data is coming hello jitesh tag guru it means our application is working fine okay so this code i will push into the github you can uh, check it out and try it i will show you the subscription also in the next video and also some additional things which present into the spring application which we can do so till the time you can play around it uh, okay uh, thanks for watching and please like share and subscribe uh, we'll meet in the next video thanks for watching bye bye